Hello everyone. Now I am going to discuss the question of the poll which I posted yesterday. The question was in photoelectric effect the ratio of slopes of curves of maximum kinetic energy of photo electron versus frequency of incident light and stopping potential versus frequency of incident light is options were h planck's constant e electronic charge m mass of electron w work function of the metal guys first of all what is photoelectric effect when a light of certain frequency strikes the surface of a metal electrons are ejected from the metal you can see in this animation when photons of light source strike the metal surface photo electrons are ejected and since circuit is complete you can see the current flowing guys please note that radiation of all the frequencies will not be able to cause the ejection of photo electrons every metal requires a minimum frequency for ejection of photo electrons and this we call as threshold frequency actually electrons are held to metal surface by some force of attraction we need to break that force of attraction the minimum energy needed for the ejection of photo electron is called work function of metal and different metals have different work functions guys photoelectric effect is explained by particle nature of the light if i say a photon of frequency nu strikes the metal surface the energy of photon will be how much h nu electron gains this much of energy now how much energy will be consumed by the metal for the ejection of electron work functions will subtract work function the remaining energy will be given to the electron and that will be in what form kinetic energy kinetic energy please note this is the maximum possible kinetic energy you can also write kinetic energy max in form of h nu minus h nu not nu not is threshold frequency guys as i told you if we complete the circuit then there will be a photoelectric current and this current increases with the increase in the intensity of light more number of photons means more number of photoelectrons but increase in kinetic energy of electron is possible only by the increase in the frequency of incident light guys now if you take an evacuated tube containing two electrodes connected to a source of variable voltage metal plate which is anode is irradiated with light photo electron will now move towards cathode but they will be repelled by cathode if kinetic energy of electron overcomes the repulsion force electron will reach to cathode now if we increase the voltage number of electrons reaching to cathode will decrease now at certain voltage let's say a uh, v not if no electron reaches to cathode this is called stopping potential that means stopping potential is able to stop electron with maximum kinetic energy so the equation which we can write is e v not is equal to kinetic energy max now what is our question we have to find the ratio of slopes of curves maximum kinetic energy of photo electron versus frequency of incident light and stopping potential versus frequency of incident light so let me write both the equations i can write kinetic energy max is equal to h nu minus w that is work function and i can also write e v not v not is what stopping potential is equal to h nu minus w so we can write v not is equal to h upon e nu minus w now if i draw graph for this y axis kinetic energy max x axis nu what will be the graph this now the graph v not versus nu what will be the graph very similar graph the difference is where in the slope y is equal to mx plus c slope is a 
here the slope is h here the slope is h upon e so what will be the ratio ratio h upon h upon e the value comes how much e so answer of the question is e hope things are clear to you if you have any doubts you can write in comment section till then bye bye